Our hotel is right in the middle of everything, and we're in the Friends of NRA truck. Nuts. Really nuts. <laughs> hey, Mom, we're number one. <laughs> we're in the big Ford F-250 diesel, and I didn't know if we'd even be able to fit through all these tabs and even be able to make it down to Times Square, but we got it done. That's where, That was our first mission, getting into New York. We're headed to Times Square. Friends of NRA are everywhere. We go everywhere. So we have to go down to Ground Zero. Ground Zero. We're going to be going to the memorial. We're also going to be meeting up with some committee members. We've we got, got a lot to do. A lot to do. Jesse, Jesse needs to ride in a cab, subway. <laughs> she wants some curbside pizza. we got a lot to do before then. That's right. Another thing that was going on was actually this week, Bin Laden was actually taken out by a group of U.S. Navy SEALs, and so there was going to be a, a heightened sense of, you know, really remembrance for September 11th. We planned this trip to New York City, you know, a couple of months ago. I don't think it could have been timed any better for our trip here to go to Ground Zero and visit the 9-11 Memorial. There was going to be a, a heightened sense of you know, really remembrance for September 11th as we rolled into New York. So we didn't really know what to expect. I had never been down to the World Trade Center or Ground Zero. This is Jesse's first trip to New York. Well, we're here at Ground Zero where the towers fell September 11th. They're reconstructing the towers, but we're just right here at the edge at the corner. We're gonna take a walk down and see if we can get a look inside the memorial and just kinda take it all in so surreal to be down here you know okay. as soon as we rounded the corner and got there and you see the site and you know the towers that are under construction it was it was an emotional moment for both of us it just it's hard to have any word really to describe what being here does but I mean the, the amount of chaos and Everything that happened, it just makes you mad. The organization that we stand for with NRA, you know, we need to be able to defend ourselves against pointless acts of violence like this was, you know. This was definitely one of the stops I wanted to make was to come down here and see the memorial. I wasn't prepared at all for the reaction that I would have when I got there. And to, to just be here and experience what we did, it was it just gave me a new look on everything, you know, that bad things happen, but it doesn't mean we have to hold on to that. 